Are you guys ready for some more insanity? A high school principal in New Jersey has come out with a ridiculous statement saying that gender-based colors used for graduation caps are offensive. So the traditional types of, of you know, caps and gowns that you guys would see uh, may no longer be the case at this one New Jersey high school. They have now scrapped a 50-year-old graduation tradition because it is offensive for students whose identity is more fluid. Okay, so they're saying this offends those who identify as not male or not female. So whatever the heck they identify as these days, there's like 50, 60 different types of gender identities that you guys can have now. Well, Glen Rock High School, they're abandoning their 50-year-old tradition of cap and gown tradition over the fact of concerns that gender-based cap colors are offensive to students with a fluid gender identity. Principal John Ariata had said in a statement this week that he declares to get rid of the gender-based graduation outfits is a step towards a more unified community. Uh, I don't think so, but anyway, that's his opinion. He says, quote, times have changed in terms of gender, gender equity, said the principal. It's really meant to be a step towards unity. No, it's a step towards insanity is what it really is. Someone said that it's been that way since 1959. My answer is that it's not 1955 anymore. Oh, no, no, guys. Got to gotta change with the times, okay? Just because it's, you know, it's 2017 going to 2018 here. So, you know, we, we can't be normal anymore, okay? We have to redefine what normal is. Well, according to a local news report, the principal had argued that gender-based colors for graduation caps might prove offensive to some students who identify as being more fluid. This is an effort to meet changing gender, meet gender, uh, gender changing dynamics, particularly to be more inclusive of those who I, whose identity is more fluid and for whom a color coordinated identifier would prove to be complicated, if not offensive. So it's just more insanity, guys. I mean, we, we see this more and more. It's all about being inclusive. It's all about not hurting somebody's feelings. These are things, guys, that have been in place, uh, like especially this school here since 1959. It is getting ridiculous, okay? These schools are absolutely out of control. I talk about these schools all the time. Pray for your kids if they go to these types of schools, guys. I mean, these schools are just really becoming indoctrination sites. Uh, I, I mean, they really are what the kids are learning there. I mean, it's not how it once was. Colleges are not preparing kids for real life. Uh, and even, you know, you can go all the way to the preschools, uh, you know, and they're, you know, poisoning these kids' minds or trying to sexualize your children, you know, trying to, you know, force LGBT, uh, force the transgender agendas and everything like that onto your kids. Uh, and, and now wanting to, you know, redefine the cap and gown color because it's offensive towards those who don't identify as a male or, or a female. It's pure insanity, guys. This world needs Jesus Christ. In fact, if you have not accepted him as your Lord and Savior, if you would like to do so, please let me know. Leave me a comment below. Let me know you would like to receive Christ as your Lord and Savior. You can be born again, forgiven of all of your sins. Come into the kingdom of God today where you will have everlasting life and a home in heaven for all of eternity. There's no greater decision you're ever going to make than to give your life to Christ. I pray you make that decision today. You can also email me directly at cardsfan480 at gmail.com. Go ahead and I'll even uh, leave the email below in the description for you guys to access from there. Any prayer requests, I would love to hear from you guys as well. So please go ahead and submit those down. All right. I'll continue here, guys, keep you updated on all the latest breaking news, prophecy headlines, and current world events. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. Don't forget to share these videos with your friends and family. God bless each and every single one of you. Merry Christmas. And I'll talk with you soon.